Hey guys, welcome back to the Kittens channel, and today I got some bad news. So, if you haven't watched my my uh, kitty tour video, go watch that real quick, and we'll see you in a couple minutes. But yeah, so that was that was from my best friend Emily, um, and we're gonna be doing a collab this weekend. So watch out for that. And but today I have some terrible news. Boots, my kitten from the Kitty Tour video, is missing. So as you know, we've moved. We've like, and it's a lot of we like he rode in the car for like an hour with dogs barking, and he freaked out. So the first day I was really worried about him because he went straight into the corner and he wouldn't move. He really liked the closet because it was dark and, you know, secluded from the everything around him. And he and he found pillows. When I unpacked and made myself a little pallet for the night, he found the pillows and started digging under them. And he buried himself with the pillows and just secluded himself from everybody. And he wasn't purring at all if you even, like, like, he really likes ear scratches and butt rubs, but he wouldn't, like, purr at all. Like, and that's not like him. If you know him, he's a very, very friendly cat. You pet him once, and he loves you. So, this was very, I was very wor worried about him. <coughs> and then, I went to go with, I went home to my mom for two days, and we came back. And my Nana and my Dad told me that he was missing. So, I don't know what to do. I'm, I, wait, I still have Gizmo. Gizmo's, you know, he doesn't really think, no, he doesn't think of nothing. He, like, he doesn't really think about Boots, like, 24-7. So, I don't think he realized that his brother is missing. And, so, yeah, he's gone. But hopefully we can find him. See, he's only been missing for like four or two, three and a half days. And so maybe there's still hope. There's still hope in my heart for his little fur baby, for his fur butt to come home. I I miss him so much. I don't know what I can do without him. You know, he's, he's like a part of me. So we hopefully we can find him. Um, I still have Gizmo. Thank, thank gosh I have one of my children. But, yeah, so that's really, really, really sad. I don't know what to do. Boots is gone. I don't, I still have a little hope. But, you know, it's like he was stressed. And I don't know. But, yeah, I just wanted to make a quick video. Tell you if he's not, if he doesn't pop up in a couple of weeks or maybe a month, then... We're going to hold a funeral for him. Even if he's not dead, but he's gone. He's not dead, but he's gone. He's, you know, gone away from people who raised him. You know, it's a new area, so even if he did get outside, he might have went off exploring. He might come home in a couple days, but he doesn't really know his home because we moved. So it's just a lot, a lot of stress on him. And, you know, yeah, it's just so sad. Uh, but hopefully we can find him and he'll be safe and home with his mom and his brothers. And he'll have some nice, warm, wet food. But, yeah, I just want to make a quick video about this. Because if you don't see him in my videos anymore, the worst had happened to him. 